What's up, Capricorns? Lori Gemini Tarot. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a reading for December 2018. Let's get to this bitch. Hope you guys are having a marvelous, marvelous good time. I hope you guys have a really good Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, Ramadan, whatever the fuck you celebrate, good for fucking you. If you don't celebrate anything either, that's pretty tight as well. So remember that this is a general collective reading. This may or may not resonate with you, okay? Take what applies, leave out the rest. Readings can go vice versa. And if this reading did not resonate with you, that's mean this reading was not meant for you. It was meant for another fucking Capricorn. So chill the fuck out, okay? Shuffling the deck for my cappies. Capricorns, December 2018. Okay. Here you are. Three of Pentacles, reverse. Could be dealing with unemployment. It could be a miscarriage. I apologize if that's the case. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, also Aquarius because of the stars. This is a situation that's not fixable. It's just two people are on a different page. Different structures of like, It's kind of like the odd couple, except, you know, one of them ends up killing each other. So let's find out what is going on. Okay, shit balls, okay. Bottom of the deck, sun card reverse. You could be dealing with a Leo, a Sagittarius. You're not happy about this situation. This, this union is not on the terms how you want it to be. It was definitely not in your favor. So with the seven of wands, you could be dealing with an Aquarius, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sag, okay? There's a lot of conflict, a lot of fighting that's going on. You're just defensive. Could be dealing with a Gemini or an Aquarius. Fucking, of course, Gemini, right? Somebody's guarded. They're like, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't have any time for your shit. No, 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 no. You're totally defensive. Like very direct to the point, it's like, ouch. And with the five of wands, I'm telling you, this is a full on war, digital fucking war, what we have here. And this Gemini and this Aquarius is just fucking shit up. I feel like it's a Aquarius because of all the stars. This is a full on clon. This is just like bickering back and forth. And with the Ace of Pentacles and the Page of Cups reverse, there's like no love. There's no, this is like over. For some of you, I do, it is like a miscarriage. For some of you, I really hate to say this. I really hate to say this. This is probably gonna be like for like 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 one percent of you, okay? This is gonna be like one person. I feel like you are in a situation where somebody wants you to get an abortion and you may not want to, or vice versa, you know? And you may end up going with it. But for the rest of you, 
it's like you're no longer going to be fighting for this because you guys are not like the love is no longer there. You're not happy with this person. Okay. Using Sawyer's Luminard. This is going to be for throwing some cards out. Okay. Okay. So snake, you're going to be dealing with the snake. This person who you're dealing with, not a nice person. This is very shady shit. Is involving multiple people. Um, it's just very argumentative, very petty. I feel like this is like ongoing. It's like if it's not in your face, then they're doing it like online. It's like somebody's trying to ruin your good name. This is definitely like somebody you should not marry. You should not be in a committed relationship with because they're not faithful. This is like somebody that's very sneaky, very lying, you know? Telling you there, there's no commitment. They're gonna like give back that fucking ring. Give that goddamn ring back. This person, not trust. They're gonna try to like, they're gonna try to like bribe you. They're gonna come over to you and be like, please baby, please baby, 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 please. Like they're gonna totally try to pull that shit. But with the Fox reverse, you're like, no, I know who you are, motherfucker. Like you see through their shit and with the key, it's like you know that you cannot grow with this individual. Now, if that reading did not resonate with you, hopefully this reading does. On Capricorns. Okay, so if the first reading did not resonate, then the second reading should. Okay. Remember, this is a general collective reading. Take what resonates with you. Reading can go vice versa. Leave out the rest if it does not resonate. And if this reading did not resonate at all, this reading was not meant for you. It was meant for another Capricorn. Okay. then two of cups reverse okay there's no love this union is over the romance is faded a misunderstanding you guys are no longer connected no longer hip to hip You guys are no like a uh, tired of resting you've thought about this for quite some time and you are leaving this person you are leaving this connection the soulmate this connection has ran its course okay just because they're your soulmate doesn't mean that they're supposed to be in your life forever soulmates you know they do come and go out of your life they teach you karmic lessons yeah, um, you need to listen to your intuition. Something is not being told to you or the other way around. There you go. 
and you're gonna give your love to somebody else, I feel like. Okay. Bottom of the deck, Ace of Swords, reverse. Okay, something is blocking you from having this beginning. So you're still stuck on like an, a Gemini, a Libra Aquarius, but this is a strong Gemini and Aquarius. Somebody, I feel like somebody, I feel like you were, you got dumped. Somebody said that they did not have feelings for you. They had feelings for somebody else. So you've already rested and you already put a lot of thought into this. You realize that it's over with the six of cups reverse and with the four of swords reverse and the two of cups reverse. The cycle has ended. High Priestess, you could be dealing with the Pisces, you could be dealing with the Cancer, you could be dealing with the Aquarius and a Gemini. Somebody has a secret. You're finding somebody alluring. This could be you, this could be somebody else. But somebody's mysterious and somebody's gonna go ahead and make an offer. But the Knight of Cups, they're going to ask you out on a date. Uh, they may come out. Um, it could be that your ex is going to come back and make an offer. And you don't have the strength to hold on to this. You could be dealing with a Leo or a Sagittarius. You feel like you're weak with this person. With the Chariot card, you're moving forward in this. You're going on charge. Cancer, Aquarius. Some of you are going back to this person again and with the Five of Swords reverse, it's like, some of you are going back to this person. Some of you are trying to like clinging on to this person. You know that this person is not for you and that there's somebody else out there for you, but you feel weak. But you need to move forward and you're blocking yourself from doing so. Okay. Alrighty then, so now let me go ahead and give you your two affirmation readings. So for Capricorn, December 2018, what messages do Capricorn for December 2018 needs to hear? Okay, love over fear. Sometimes saying nothing is the most powerful expression. And stop taking shit as payment for your love. Now I'm gonna go ahead and give you your body positive, badass affirmations. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and mix these cards up. Mixing these up, not looking, not cheating. So these are messages that you need to hear, Capricorns, for December 2018. Holidays suck. You can't resist but eat nothing but bad food. Okay. Message one, my brains, my body, and my soul are the 
fucking bomb diggity. Loving my body is so easy. I look down and say, hey body, I fucking love you. My body doesn't deserve, but my body doesn't fucking define me. Holy shit, Lori Reed. And finally, today I will be a magnet for some amazing fucking positivity. Hell yes. Hopefully this reading resonated with you. If it did, please like and subscribe to this channel. Also follow me on Instagram, Lori Gemini Tarot. I post daily tarot, oracle, affirmation readings, and I do a lot of live streamings and uh, do readings. So thank you. I love my Capricorns and booyah.